This piece of shit. Oh, it's working now. Oh, yeah. Now we're actually recording. Third time in a row. Done this fucking video. All right. So we just got back from Rough Tail 19 hours ago because this fucking phone. Uh, third time's the charm. Trying to use this fucking thing, and it's not working too great. Testicles? One, two, three. <laughs> that way you can hear us because it's raining and shit. Um, so we got back from Rough Tales a couple hours ago, and uh, great time. Uh, how was your experience compared to last year? Compared to last year, it was more relaxing, hanging out with people, because we didn't do any videos at all. No reviews. We were there twice as long. Yeah, I just hung out with people. Cons, last year I enjoyed the fact of you get a bracelet and stuff like that, and you know you just go around and get whatever beer. You pay first initial price, then you get whatever beer. And there was other breweries there also, and which I liked it because you got to talk to other breweries about them and their beer and try mm -hmm. their beer. And, and some of them was beer that you can't get in the store. Yeah. So it was great that they were there because you got to try the beer and all those ones that you couldn't get in the store. Fucking amazing beer. Yeah. Uh, we did see a couple of guys from Vanessa, Vanessa House. They don't know me, I'm sure. If they do, they probably think I'm a prick. Um, didn't say anything to them. Was eh, new. Eh, eh, whatever. whatever. Prick. I, this year was about me enjoying the damn moment. I'm not yeah. going around trying to solicit nothing. I'm not going around trying to do anything. It Reviews just views or any. Yeah, I don't care. Uh, this is about hanging out with Jesse and Newman and his girlfriend and Travis and his fiance and running into fellow reviewers and yeah uh, Patrick making it grain uh, Chris uh, it was a great time up there Kate um, I will say the the Crowler area it was probably the biggest downfall for me for uh, I mean it, sure it's cool for sales uh, the lines were long a lot of you know pretty much a third of the people there was over in the crowler line area it's completely separate away from rough tail um and that's where most of the people hung out all day oh yeah there were people there with their trunks yeah. open music yep. going and chairs sitting out and just chilling over there yeah by the crowler um not even over at the actual party there's some people i wouldn't i wanted to see uh, i did see will um he was one of those people that hung over there all day um you know, we just kind of a hit and miss on, on Facebook Messenger. I wasn't going to abandon the people I was already talking to just to go over there and say what's up. Um, did pick up a four-pack of the a fourth anniversary ale. No. We'll re be uh, reviewing that tonight. Yeah, one to Tom. Yep. I uh, got some other beers from Tom. Tom Chalice. Great Good guy. dude. Uh, what all beers do we get? We got the Wheat Dreams... Hoptometrist, hoptometrist with grapefruit. Um, Hoptometrist curry. Oh, that was the best. That was the, the highlight best. of the day. Yeah. That was badass. They have to can it. I told, uh, to. told Blaine and I told... Uh, uh, what fucking name just for gave me? Tom. No. Tim. J. Bond. Son of a bitch. We just said it in the other Tony. video that don't fucking... Fuck there me. it is, Tony. I know it was a T. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> that they have to can it. Um... It was awesome. Yeah, it was great beer. What else did we get? Oh, uh, we also got the, uh, what was that, the seasonal IPA or the, oh. the session IPA? Yeah, the session IPA. Oh. We also got the um, passion fruit uh, pale ale. Oh, yeah. Was it the pale ale or the hotometrist? No, it, pale I ale. Think it was the pale ale. It that was one was really, acidy. really acidic. Yeah. But it wasn't bad. I mean, yeah, it's. Have a little kick to it. Something if you are, if you already have heartburn, don't drink it. Yeah. Um, it was a good time. I there was you know it's kind of hit and miss on on drone deal. That was badass. Yeah, that, that was, was cool. Sweet. That, that gave good interview. The first you know couple hours there, you know everyone was hanging out, talking, drinking, and then watching the drone drops and stuff. And then it seemed like it kind of died down once the drone deal was done. You know what yeah. I mean? There wasn't really nothing going on that was catching people's attention. Yeah, about five o'clock it was. It was a, a lot of people had left by that time. Yeah. Um, but that drone deal, that was a cool idea. They did great on that. It really wasn't nothing to it. Didn't do any reviews. Nope. Took some pictures. That all I did. Some selfies. Yeah. <laughs> I'll hang out. Um, 
That's Travis. You see his phone number? No, it just says name. Oh. Alright. Hello. We'll be seeing you.